안녕하십니까 여러분 저는 연극 아치입니다 Hello and welcome to a brand new PPT bomb game which I actually made just this week so let's get straight into it this is a Peppa Pig game and at the beginning there's an embedded video file with the uh, Peppa Pig intro I know nothing about this animation but my students told me it's um, according to them it's very exciting and so far this game has been a big hit so there's intro slide there and another slide here just bypass that and then let's talk about the point system um, they get one point each for the Peppa Pig character in a slide like this one uh, there's also a choice slide uh, for this one just click on the peak character and it will reveal the points there's a bomb uh, six points six points again and change points and yeah change points again here so if they get this slide as a slide or in the choice they can change points with another team and there's also some minus points <laughs> this one's quite fun there you go into the pumpkin and minus five points and there's a bomb uh, you will only find the bomb in the choice um, questions. Okay. Oh, last one here. Um, if they get this slide, they're actually going to be able to get lots of points. There's no bombs, there's no change, just high points. So look, you've got 10 points there and 5 points there. Good. So, let's play. I keep this nice and brief today. There are 21 questions. Um... I made it 21 because I usually play uh, with three teams and this should allow you to get seven rounds with three teams but 21 there's enough questions for uh, bigger classes with more teams so let me just choose some numbers so for example number one uh, you can put your question in here put your paste your picture into here and you've got your answer here and all you have to do is just click on the orange box and then you will go straight into the points. So this one we got five points. And if you go to the top right hand corner, you will see there's the pig character there. Just click on that. It will take you back to the main screen. Let's choose another number. Number two. Uh, you know, change the question in the yellow box. Make a question as you want paste a picture into the, the white uh, rectangular box and then write your own answer and this one here is the choice so just click on the pig character got change points there six points there there's a bomb and another six points okay each choice slide is uh, different click on the pig character in the top right hand corner and you go back to the main screen uh, next I'm going to choose number eight uh, write in your question picture and answer click on the orange box and this time we've got change points so students can change points with one of the other teams click on the right pig sorry the pig in the right hand side at the top corner there and that will take you back to the main screen again let's choose number 10 question and answer and click on the orange box and there you go <laughs> there's the minus points um, I played this game a few times the kids really like this uh, this slide okay and go back to the main screen the last one I'm going to look at is number 19 write in your question and write in your answer and here we go power piggy points choice click on number two got five points click on number one we got 10 points and click on the pig in the top right hand corner to go back to the main screen so that is it it's a great game and it was working very well kids seem to like it a lot just remember all you've got to do is just make your question as you want in the top and then make an answer in the bottom and then paste in any picture as you want and that's about it. I've kept it nice and brief today. And you're welcome to download this. Please use it as much as you want. Um, if you have any suggestions on how I can change it or make it better, 
or any suggestion about a game you would like to see me make because I can literally make anything and embed video files the lot. So thank you very much for watching this video. <laughs> if you watch this video, uh, please subscribe if you feel in the mood, uh, but no pressure to do that. And um, have a great day and enjoy your teaching. Bye bye.